what's up welders welcome to another episode of adventures in weld i'm paul thanks for joining me today we are going to be talking about open root welding that means we are going to be welding the back side of something from the front side of it and we're going to do this in three separate parts the first part what we're going to get into today is open root shielded metal arc welding or open root stick welding we're going to be using uh, deep digging fast freeze electrodes such as the 6010 and 6011 i'm going to show you how to bevel your plates and the techniques we're going to use to manipulate those electrodes let's get started all right, folks, I got our plate here that we're going to be using today. This is some 3 8 inch mild steel, and we're just going to whack out a couple of coupons that we need to uh, get beveled and ready for our open root weld. So, step one is we need to cut them out. Now, there's many different ways you can cut steel. You can use a cutoff disc, a bandsaw, a plasma cutter, a torch, as many different ways as you can think of. Personally, I prefer the katana. It's quick, it's easy. Even though the katana imparts a nice smooth cut, we're going to hit this with a grinder, flatten this out, and then grind our belt. All right, there we've got our angle, and we've got our land, which is the flat spot right there. I like to have about an eighth inch land. So here is an eighth inch TIG rod, and you can see how that covers it up there nicely. That gives us a little bit of meat to work with right there on the edge. Now, the next thing we need to do is to get the male scale off of here and off of here about a half an inch back. Nothing to it really. All right, the next step, we've got our plates ready, they're beveled. I flipped them over, as you can see, so that the bevel is down. And I bent a, uh, that 1 8 inch piece of TIG wire to act as a spacer. And that's going to give us our 1 8 inch spacing. So now we're going to tack it from the back and we'll be ready to roll. Alright, now that we've got our preliminary tacking done, we can pull out our spacer wire, which is sometimes easier said than done. And we just want to beef up our tacks real good.
All right, folks, what we're going to be trying to do here is to weld this, the back side of the joint, from the front side. Now, this is what you have to do if you're dealing with uh, large box tubing or pipe, because there's no way you're going to be able to get your stinger and your rod inside there. So what has to happen is you're using that deep digging rod, the 6010 or the 6011, and you're going to shove it clear in there, clear as far as you can in the bevel. So what's happening is it is spitting metal out here. You're going to burn through that land and you are going to deposit metal on the back side from the front side. I know it sounds crazy, but that's the way we do it. Alright, I've exaggerated the whip and pause a little bit here so you can uh, get an idea of what's going on. What's happening is the rod is burning through the land and then we are jumping out of the molten metal to allow it to freeze and fill in and then we come back and add more metal and scoop out some more. So we scoop, jump, fill. Scoop, jump, fill. The whooshing sound is what we want to hear. That's the sound of us scooping out the back of the plate. If you wonder what I'm doing here, my keyhole got a little bit too big. Oh, whoa! That thing's still steaming like a turd the ex-wife left in my toilet last week. Sorry. Anyway, there's our root pass. There's our, there's our root pass, damn it. And uh, it's down in there. And there is the prettiness. <coughs> you can see the nice, even beating on the back. What we've done again is we have welded the back from the front. Now what you do if you were doing this for a test or if you were actually fabricating something is you would come in here with a grinder, grind that all nice and smooth, and then fill it with some 7018 or MIG or you know whatever your taste happens to be lying in these matters. So that's it for our open root stick welding extravaganza. Next time we'll talk about doing the same thing with MIG. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, share, subscribe. Now go on, get, get out of here. Why are you still looking at me, boy? <laughs>